looking again, looking in my rear vision mirror, making an active head movement and coming down the road at the speed limit of course. Alright, mirrors, mirrors, indicator and I'm just going to check over my shoulder. So here we are again, back from the line looking. Again, these white lines over here and over here, you can't break them all this corner. So I come out with my head up, face my chin in the direction I want to go and apply the throttle. Alright, blinkers off. And that's about it. Ah, uh, scan. Yeah, scan here, scan there, which I didn't do. He got me to go up that road too. Um, Alright, and here we go again. He calls this an intersection, so you know, he said turn left at the next intersection. I was like, it's not an intersection, it's just a street. Watch out for the car, the door, scanning there, coming up to the lights. To me, this is an intersection, all right? So I'm going to slow down, it's a green light, but I want to be able to stop if I need to. So I'm going to scan what's there, it looks like a rest zone. Scanning there, you know, and I'm just cruising down the road. Now I'm coming up to a main drag, which is where I went, and I'm going to indicate. I think we're just about done on daylight, so it's going to be a pretty bad video. So, um, what is that? Eight minutes. I'll go a little bit longer. So here we go. Look on the inside of my right, and I'm coming out into this lane. I don't go wide. Now... I'm going to indicate to say I'm coming over, I'm going to shoulder roll, right? So that lane was two that split into, uh, that joined into one scan, physical scan, staying to the speed limit, 60k, right? Scanning all down here, scan, he makes you do this. Watch out for this, I think it's a raised bed, yeah it is. So just give some breaks, looking in our mirror of course, because we don't want to get slammed at the rear end, right? Scanning down there. And moving up here. Oh, I think we can see okay. Alright. Scan. Mirrors. Mirrors. This was like full of traffic. So it was easy to stick the speed limit. Scanning there. You can't scan when you're gone past, by the way. There was a couple of times I was just like, oh, there it is. Nah, I wasn't happy. So, mirrors. Mirrors indicate we're going around to the right hand side so I slow down and this was busy man so people are pummeling through here so I'm just going to go around here and then we indicate to go off and I look on the inside and then we take that corner away we go all right again up here so we went up the top of the brow um, never been up this way before so that's the muse uh, this and then he got me to pull over yeah I think it, I think it was back there before the brow but I'm gonna pull over so I've indicated I'm looking over on the inside and I'm gonna pull over here I thought this was really dumb because I mean I would just pull up you know like this parallel no wonder he got me to do it back there it's gonna be pretty hard here but you don't want to be parked like this you want to actually be 90 degrees with your wheel I've got my blinker on at the moment while well, I'm just looking in the mirror at the cars coming up behind me there's going to be no way I'm going to park out with my back wheel into the curb or can I look over my shoulder yeah bugger it let's do it right okay so this isn't quite 90 degrees I've got my right hand blinker on and now we can take off right so away we go right hand always the right hand now come in here looking on the inside and we make sure to indicate to come off this is a bit tricky might get dark down here so I think this is 60 k's so this is terrible on a I think it was a Friday 60 kilometers down here all right and all this going on high crash area blah 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 you know, I think I was stuck in third all the way around here. Yeah, so I'm... Um, oh, the other thing. See, I'm on the inside of this road, right? 
um, not the place to be okay so see this corner I need to be on the outside like I am now so I'm off to the left of the lane and reason being is when you're driving see I, I can't see around this 35k road so I need to be stuck on the outside here and this is where I did terribly bad see these cars right up my backside so I'm, I'm right on the outside of the lane now I'm going to indicate roll my shoulder over and let this car go past I'm slowing down a bit right because I'm a slow vehicle look over my shoulder where I go I'll let this guy speed through but what he actually said to me was when you're in these kind of country roads right see this um, when I'm coming up to this corner I can't see around that corner so I should be out here because I need to see around that corner right and then on this side I should be coming on the inside here so I've got a better point of view looking across the corner right so here I'm on the outside uh, the inside of that well well I'm on the left side right here I do again so I'm kind of in the middle coming over the brow 60 kilometers man this was tough right and I don't mind being on the inside here you know because I'm safe but when it's a right hand turn so left hand turn go on the left side I think it's always the left side actually when you think about it you just want to be able to see around that bend sorry right you go left left you go so here I should be out here so I can 